Lord says, The strangers shall fade away and be afraid out of their close places. Say this prayer in the name of Jesus. Every stranger in my health, family, and finance, get out in the name of Jesus. I am free in Jesus' name. Say this prayer. Father, in the name of Jesus, I speak to the womb of July and the second half of this year. Be fruitful in the name of Jesus. No matter how small the gathering may be, people will gather together to rejoice with me this year. Happy is the person who honors the Lord, who takes pleasure in obeying his commands. His family will be wealthy and rich, and he will be prosperous forever. I pray for you, as you honor God, live righteously, and do his will. You will be rich, wealthy, and prosperous in Jesus' name. God is spirit, and those who worship him must worship in spirit and truth. The Lord blesses everyone who freely gives food to the poor. You are going to receive a large amount of money very soon. A prayer for the weak. God, this week, we not only give you a chance, but our lives. We give you our prayers and our broken hearts. We give you our temptations and our limitations. We give you our weaknesses and are not enough. We know that in you, all things work together for our good and your glory. Help us live as though we have access to the uncreated Creator's power, presence, and provision because we do. Help us to remember who we are in you and because of you. In Jesus' name, I am the Lord. I am the God of every person on earth. You know that nothing is impossible for me. You were always more distant and prepared to wait things out. You never felt the need to address life's obstacles quickly, which is why you never felt the need to be disturbed by them. To discern the genuine motives of individuals they come into contact with, to fortify their soul, and to envelop them in your heavenly angels directing their heart and their ways. Given how well your patience has benefited you, it makes sense. One's personality will always have an inherent balance, nevertheless. In addition to reaping the rewards of your virtues, there are certain things you should be on the lookout for if you want to have a balanced life. Your patience and laid-back attitude are the ideal illustration. I have the wisdom of the Holy Spirit within me, and I am discerning and wise. I will only put my trust in people who have demonstrated their sincerity and integrity. Whatever the circumstance, patience is a virtue and a great quality to possess. But if you have too much patience, you can find yourself standing still when you should be rushing. As a result, chances can and probably will slip by. I am surrounded by God's protection, which keeps those who would try to trick me at bay. Contrarily, that individual is this. They will take advantage of opportunities when they arise because they recognize their significance. However, they can also be impatient which is why they are putting so much effort into planning for their eventual reveal. Type yes if you believe in God. God bless you.